Hi everyone, my name is Justine and I will show you how to cook a apple raisin crumble. I found this recipe on the Canadian Diabetes Association. So there's not a lot of sugar in the recipe, but still if there's too much sugar for you, you can always reduce the amounts of dark brown sugar or only we use and make it uh, perfect for you or what you need. The main ingredients in this recipe are the apples. They will bring their sweetness to the recipe and also provide your body um, vitamins, minerals and uh, fibers too. The first ingredient you need are apples. You need 8 apples and 2 of them have to be Granny Smith apples and the 6 others you can choose between uh, Macintosh, Jonathan or Gala apples. Now for the second ingredient, you need raisins. You need 75 milliliters, which is the equivalent of one third of a cup of uh, raisins. I chose the ones in little boxes like that because you don't need a lot of raisins, so you don't have to buy a really big, big bag of raisins, and it's a lot cheaper to buy in little boxes like that. I think I use four boxes like that. Now, the third ingredient you'll need for this recipe is dark brown sugar. You'll need uh, two tablespoons at the beginning of the recipe and then later on you'll need another one. So, in total it's three tablespoons of uh, dark brown sugar. Then, you'll need half of a teaspoon of brown cinnamon. You'll need one teaspoon of vanilla extract, you need one tablespoon of cornstarch and one tablespoon of canola oil. Now for the last two ingredients you'll need 12 ginger snap cookies and then you have to choose between honey or maple syrup for the last one. First preheat the oven at 350 Fahrenheit. Then in a mixing bowl combine the raisins the dark brown sugar, the vanilla extract, the cornstarch, and the apples. The apples need to be unpeeled and chopped into pieces. Toss gently until the cornstarch is dissolved and then place it in a baking dish and set aside. Place the ginger snap cookies in a plastic bag and crush them to the texture you'd like. Then, in a small mixing bowl, add the remaining ingredients except the syrup or honey. Put the ginger snap cookies, the ground cinnamon, the dark brown sugar, and the canola oil. Stir to blend and sprinkle over the apple mix. Bake uncovered and wait 45 minutes. Remove from heat and then put honey or maple syrup on top of it and let it stand for 10 minutes. And then it's ready to serve.